Welcome back to Let's Play Death Spank, Thongs of Virtue. I'm Burning Dog Face, and every time I say that, it sounds more and more like a fake video game they'd make up for a movie. <laughs> Mugger note? Library note. Okay. For some saucy reading material, check out the Lebeau Kukel Library. They have a great cooking section. I had that one already. In fact, it's, ex it's still here. Okay, that's weird. Destroyed city photo. There is a giant thumb in the center of this photo. Jungle green whistle, mating whistle, sp tuned specifically for the green, sorry, for the green queen in the jungle. Oh no, I'm looking at stuff. Uh, rhinestone wristwatch looks cheap, but costs a fortune. Wait, uh, necklace of reuse. This tiny trinket was crafted by still tinier hands. So to them, it must have seemed huge. Uh, flamethrower, family unfriendly fun. I saw that. Uh, I put this back on because the jackhammer was fun, but I don't think hitting one guy didn't seem that great, especially since it wasn't even killing dudes in one hit. This one might do the trick, though. Railroad sledgehammer drives foes into the ground with incredible force. Why don't I come back to town? Potions! I think he was... Yeah, there you are. Hello, Carl. Greetings, potion person. I'm looking to buy some potions. He's not making the potion seller joke because this was like a decade before that happened. Uh, yes. All right, you never have too much of that. Here are your terrible photos. Greetings, media personality. Bam! Whoa! Three devastatingly amazing photos. What are these? Is that your thumb? And this one is completely black. Did you even take the lens cap off? Come to think of it, pictures aren't needed for radio anyway. What's important is that you were there. I'll take my camera back now. I'll just turn these broken tubes into usable repair parts. There, that oh. was easy for this savvy newsman. Unfortunately, I can't leave my news desk in case any special reports come in. Then guard your desk, noble newsman. I'll fix your radio tellers. That's swell, Death Spank. But you'll be needing these first. Go now and fix those towers. Maybe the first game took place in an intentionally obsolete society. Like in the village. P.S. Spoilers. The spoilers for a movie from like 2004, so I figure I'm good. What am I doing? I don't need to run there. Smashing stuff is fun, though. I don't even, I'm not even paying attention to how much money I'm picking up. I just check the thing when I want to buy something. Now, you might be wondering why this uh, outhouse looks totally intact, but I will remind you that apparently this place before it was destroyed was already called the Destroyed City. Ah, yes, that's right. What I wanted to do to start things off was to pull this lever and pull and uh, complete a quest. Drawbridge control lever. That is a strange place to put that. You can't even see it from here. You have to roll the world to get there. This luck has a circle, a diamond, and a horseshoe on it. I'm going to write that down. Oops, I have to think over. Circle. Diamond. Horseshoe. Okay. Rad. 
Huh, just realized this thing here looks like a tank tread without a tank cannon attached to it. Uh, turret! Turret, that's the word I'm thinking of. Hey, 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 hey! No bullet fights, even if you are shooting blanks. This is weird. Seriously, what are they doing? Why were they programmed to be able to do that? Oh. Fuck you, nothing in particular. Oh no. Stupid. Let's zoom way out and look for more gray orcs. Ooh, a Spartan sword. Just the bare necessities to kill! And of course it does 300 damage. Who else, what else would it do? I'm pretty sure the shape of that blade is very specifically based on the swords from 300. Which, in their defense, only came out five years before this game. So, you know, still relevant. Man, I can't judge distances for shit. I really thought that guy was going to get taken out by that. Just as I thought I would be safe for those other ones I blew up. I do like when the drums get all excited. You know, my father uh, is an engineer, and he never so he has never once exploded, to my knowledge. Oh, oh shit. Aw, oh, fuck. There you are. Oh, right, fire. Duh. Duh! I knew that. There you are. Fuck. Okay. Elemental weaknesses. Definitely a thing. You dropped a lot of shit for just suicide, goon. Aw, oh, no, another one! I can see that guy in there. Yoink! You know what? Oh, they didn't like that at all. Oh yeah, and I auto-equipped this because I didn't have anything in that slot. Leaded wristwatch, the traditional gift for a hero's 25th anniversary. Uh, why did I... Oh, right, I wanted to read this. Yes, good. Okay. I guess I should really learn how to block, huh? Oh, fuck. Huh, interesting. I'll just, uh, run the fuck away and eat some nachos. Which is often a good, uh, a good solution to a problem, really. There. Why did I want to bridge down? To get into the skeleton farm, that's right. That was very satisfying. That guy just shows up and like, where the fuck is everyone? Now that I think about it, it's right here. Yeah. Hi, it's me, Deathspank. I'm here to kill all of you. Orc Post 4, beware our guns and explosives. Now just kill it. It'll be fine. Bazooka Trooper, fuck. 
Yeah, that does it. You're not gray. We're not the right gray, anyway. He's just charging me because all he has is a knife for some insane reason. 37 plates and nachos. Oh, hey, it's one of those towers. Uh, vacuum tube. This is a great vacuum tube. Just look at that vacuum. I didn't think that would do anything. Ooh, only one left. Uh, why am I in here? God damn it, me. Well, I got more of this, so... Let me see here. 30 health, 4% resi nature resistance. 30... Five health, uh, four percent nature resistance. Down it goes. Let's recycle that. Yeah. And while we're at it, the sword. Uh, I guess I'll get rid of the jackhammer. Attention, apparently. Yeah. I remember there was something in the first game that I needed to collect a very, very large number of, but I was under the impression I was doing it for most of the game, rather than this quest, where I completed it basically immediately. I'm just gonna orbit these barrels until I'm done. There we go. Nice. Oh, I did waste a bunch of bullets, though. Oh, fuck. My precious buns. God damn you! Why don't I just equip? No, it's the same fucking one. Thought I'd, like, thrown this thing on. Perfectly normal, preloaded, disposable machine gun. <laughs> I like that. Uh... Oh. Ow! No! That was not the wisest thing you've ever done, I gotta say. I didn't even know you, and I know that to be true, because you just shot me in the face with point blank range with a rocket launcher. <laughs> you profound dumbass. Dr. Eisenbein, journal. Page 15. Progressing to Wharton's factory, the new shipment of Mark 7 robots. The Mark 6 robots are carrying the shipment crates of these. I was kind of expecting skeletons, I have to admit. Well, there you go, that had very good timing. Neighborhood watch notice. Undead commanders plague the land. Do not attempt to fight them. They are immune to all known weapons. That is a very gross skeleton. Aw, oh, fuck. I didn't notice my health. Ah! It's one of the invincible commanders. Sucks. There is no dead adventurer there, I'll take your word for it. That's where it came from. Thigh bone. Ironically, I'm finding these in their arms. What? Dead adventurer note 15. Undead commanders. None of my weapons can hurt the undead commander. It's the only thing to do is avoid them. Oh no, one of them is coming this way. Should put this pen and paper down and run before our
Oh man. Is it almost no damage, interestingly? Ugh. Fucking smash your stupid hat. They keep, seem to be throwing poison grenades, so uh, I'm just going to go ahead and... Uh... Honestly, spinning around to circle Hindus with melee weapons seems to be way more effective than shooting them. How many of you fuckers are there? Come on! Oh, that was really, really, really satisfying. Mmm, tasty. Oh, you're the other guy, okay. Damn it. Still resistant. Nice. Death to all of you! Uh, more death to all of you! I'm gonna haunt you like all those turkeys that didn't get pardoned haunt every president. They don't tell you about that part, but, uh... Ooh boy, it's hard to deal with. Well, so I hear. I've never been president myself. <laughs> Thought about it, but somehow I didn't think it would go so well. Cannibal noticed there isn't an orc mugger running around in Labelle a bow. Oh, no new armor. Tanks would run in terror from this chest if they had legs. Plus 60. Plus 70, yeah. No, what did it say? This jacket is better than your dad's jacket. Well, then my dad's jacket is now the best. It looks like I'm wearing a grenade. If I put on all of these, am I just going to look like a transformer? Yes, the answer is yes. I didn't notice the fucking exhaust pipes before. Or cannons? I don't know. How many of those are there, anyway? Three more. Okay. So I'm assuming what I need to do there is go back to the camp and then walk towards the thing, uh, the thing, the town, in order to find the guy. As opposed to just going straight to the town. Uh oh. I mean, I'm pretty sure these are too close together to be necessary, but, you know, not my job. I'm just the guy who's fixing them. Over this way, boys. I take it back. Shooting them is way more effective. <laughs> I used one bullet and killed all of them. Oddly warm chest piece. I don't, that's not going to be any good anymore, but I uh, do want to see what that looks like. Okay, then. I think that's a recolor of one from the uh, base game. Base game? The first game. Or the first chapter, or whatever the fuck you want to call it. I don't know anymore. Uh, yeah. Sure. Ow, oh, 
God damn it. Alright, there's the timer. I'll just, uh... Who the fuck is over there? Well, let's go investigate that and call it an episode. Excuse me. Pardon me. Not a blockage, it's a, uh... Barricade? Neighborhood watch notice. Oh, it's the same size on the other side. Man-eating humanoid mountains. It's not poetic, but I was running away when I came up with it. Okay, we're going this way. Another journal. Page 23. Successfully delivered the Mark 7 robots to Wharton's factory, and now we're turning home. All is well. Not where I was expecting that to go, but okay. It's really not that bad being around these guys. You just gotta walk where the bullets aren't. It's the same trick to staying dry in a, in a rainstorm. Greetings, soldier. Oh, we're gonna get annihilated. Who's going to Anahidu Hill Madam? And I'll get this. Who's going to attack you? The orcs are trying to recruit the giant pips. We need to stop these two groups from joining forces, or it's game over, man. Game over. R.I.P. Bill Paxton. Lucky for you, I, I live to vanquish evil. He didn't turn out to be an asshole, did he? I'll bring you the pips' teeth as proof of my heroicosity. Oh, is that really necessary? You betcha. You'd best keep those teeth too. I'll know. I'm Burning Dog Face, and I'll see you on the next episode of Let's Play Death Spank, Thongs of Virtue, and we're doing some more quests and find out what a giant pip is. Later.